Hello, Aries. <laughs> this is going to be your um, five minute love messages. The song by um, Janine and Kiko, The Worst. So I feel like Aries, someone feels like this situation could be the worst for them. Or you probably feel like the, somebody you invested in was the worst situation that you probably had to do. Or maybe you feel like it was the worst because you probably felt you wasted your time. And, you know, shit just didn't end right. So my hair is kind of sticking out, y'all. Rough day. But let's get into it. Dear Spirit, God, Aiden, and Ancestors. Um, please bless Aries with these messages. I'm just going to really show y'all the cards and really instead my face. Dear Spirit, God, Angels, and Ancestors, please bless Aries with these messages. It is the truth of the matter when it comes down to Aries and their love life. Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising. Spirit. But I don't need you, but I want you. So, Aries, I feel like... You don't need this person, but you want them. I don't need you, but I want to. So, everything that you say now. This person feels like you, you feel confused with this person, Aries. Shut up. Like, tell me what you say now. Y'all look lightning. I hope y'all can see the card. Uh-oh. These cards acting up over here. I feel like there was some kind of shocking news. That you found out about your person. Sudden change. And this sudden change came out of fucking nowhere. You know how lightning hits out of nowhere? This this is what your situation was like. It fucks your hell up. Shocking news. Sudden change. Surprise. Epiphany. Upheal. Upheal and then transformation. And it made you want to transform your life. Because whatever information you found out got you like... Oh, shit. Like, I thought I knew my person. Guess not. What else, spirit? Baby. Look, girl talk. I feel like you and this person had a lot of passion, Aries. Insane chemistry, liking each other, equally having fun. I feel like this person just wanted to have passion and fun and not fall in love. And I feel like maybe that's where the disconnect was. Photograph. Now, some of y'all could be stalking this person, Aries, or it could be either or. But I feel like you do look at old photos of this person. You start to get, you know, in your, in your feelings. But I feel like there's someone who wants to talk to you about it, like, like some friends and families who got your side. Spend time alone, moving on, happily single, living more, having fun. And you're just trying to have some fun, Aries. Now you're like, fuck love. I'm all about my coins. Looking at your photos, missing your nostalgia, making new memories. You're trying to make memories. But you're not also trying to hold on to the past too long. Like, you're not. Look, clock came out, too. Look. Yeah, you're doing a lot of healing, Aries. Need time, time cycles, um, time to heal, uh, progress. You're making a lot of progress on your own. And Spirit said, congratulations. Now, we're going to get into it with Tarot. And then I'm going to pull you the Romance Angel cards. That's going to be it. Look, baby. Aries, look. Mm -hmm. I turned into y'all done moved on, or you're about to, and the two of cups is here. I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take both of them. Yeah. Some of y'all, y'all just had a y'all ended a long term relationship with someone, or you're about to, and if it ended, I can guarantee y'all about to fall right back into something new. And this new shit is going to have you not even thinking about your ex. <laughs> Aries. Ah, what else for Aries? Look, I'm telling you. Y'all about to meet a king, Aries. Y'all about to meet your king or your queen. Yeah, king of cups. This person going to be spiritually, you know, on your level, mentally, physically. Baby, baby. Look, hey there, by Vija. Hey there. This person's gonna be like, hey there, but some of y'all gonna be intimidated by this person of cups because you're still kind of broken hearted, Aries. I'm not gonna throw. You are you're kind of broken hearted about the situation that happened, you know. But look, this person gonna be stable. And there's two kings out here. Two fucking kings. Look, and you in a little bit of regret. Because I feel like maybe, you know, you was going a little too fast with somebody and they cut you off. Or they just stopped the connection overall. And you're like, what the fuck? Like, everything was going so good. 
Like, why'd you stop? Look, baby. Because it was just too much conflict. But you becoming a queen of pentacles anyways. You become a bad bitch. King, queen, baby. Can't make it up. This is going to take time. Now, we're going to get your romance, angel answers, and that's going to be it. What's Aries' message? Spirit said, stop. Oh, engagement! Aries, if y'all about to be getting engaged, but the chemistry is always going to be there. Your love life is ascending to a high level of commitment. Yes! That was your love reading for you, Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising. I will see y'all next time. Goodbye.